Got it hooked up in this month. We in here. Okay, cool. We about to bless. Wait, I know. That's that's the high priest. That's the high priestess. All right, so we're going to go ahead and bless this this session real quick. You know, we got some nice saves. You know, we're natives. Natural natives. You know, indigenous natives. So anyway, so we're going ahead and do this week. Fire signs. This is being fire sign season. Alright? So I'm going to set this on to the side real quick. So we're gonna see this must this must be what I be feeling because right now I'm feeling the energy of the, the passionate ones. You know what I mean? So the fire signs that's dealing with the Leo, uh, Aries, and Sagittarius. And you know, sidereally, I'm a Leo, so I feel it. Alright? So uh, and I got the wind sidereally from the high priest is over there, which is my my, uh, my empress, my young empress. You know? So, we're going to jump right into this. Oh, snap. I done went dark on y'all. Ooh, we back, we back. All right, cool. Step. Oh, it's straight, baby. It's straight. It's cool. All right, so we're going to jump in with the good old nice smooth tarot. And, uh, First of all, I don't even know why I'm going to say the tarot. We're going to jump into the whole, to get a little, uh, the oracle card real quick and see what the, uh, what this, what this, uh, we can jump into this energy with because it's nice and smooth right now. I like it. I feel it. Okay, so let me go ahead and just check it out. Um, boom. Energy. Oh, the camel pose. Man, it's like me. I do got one of them big ass camel lips and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? The camel pose. We're going to see what that is. So the oracle say what they what they say about that. I just had to grab this and see what the camel pose mean. We know camels is uh is very very patient. You know we know they go ahead and uh, get across uh, sticky situations or hot situations. I should say across the desert. So uh, people use them. Sometimes they can misuse them too. So you know gotta be careful, man. If you got one of them dang on camels, man, you just putting everything on the back. But let's see what some good stuff they have to say about the camel. All right, so. What are your limits? That's what we was talking about. Being careful putting stuff on the back. What are your limits? Being able to find that out. You know, um, when was the last time you was out and out your comfort zone? Travel can help you expand at this time. Whew, man, telling you, I'm probably feeling it too. Shell, the affirmation is, uh, my breath helps me adapt to any situation. My breath. The camel pose. Hey, don't, don't be laughing this shit, y'all. All right. <laughs> so we're going to jump right into it. We're going to see what the cards say over here. The tear joints. We're going to pop it off. See what the fire signs got going. Right now, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. What y'all got crack a lady right now in the game? Let me fill you up. Okay, cool. Boom. First card of the read. Bro. Queen Swartz. Smooth. Alright. So you probably feeling like uh, you know, straight up on your game, you know what I'm saying? Mental incision is like, you know, just super phenomenal right now. You know what I'm saying? You 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 wanna get your uh, you wanna cut off things that's in your life, you know, uh you ain't having no shit right now, all right? This is the fire sign. They they cutting out anything that ain't beneficial to them right now. So, you already know. First card of the reading is the strongest, Nick. So, and also the bottom of the, uh, whew, the bottom of the deck, three of cups. So, you cutting off somebody. Cutting off something. That's dealing with love, all right? No more, no more three-party situations. Right, so we're gonna go ahead and keep it moving. My Sagittarius is and uh Aries and uh Leo's. So we in Leo season. Tropically, we in Leo season. So we're gonna have that tropical effect. So let's get it cracked. Okay, you know what I'm saying? It's kinda one to pop out. Oh, oh, oh damn, hold, hold up, hold up. Damn, Leo! Damn Sagittarius! <laughs> Aries, what the hell is up with y'all? Y'all got some stuff to say. Hold up, hold up. 
Let me go ahead and make sure. Let me just take this right and bring out. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, cool. These two want to come out. I'm gonna take. Them. I'm gonna take. Them. Boom. What you thinking about, huh? Two cups. What? Thinking about some mutual love. Whoever you thinking about is thinking about that with you too. I'm telling you that right now. Whoever you thinking about is thinking about that with you too. You know, very uh, uh could be a, a good innocent love. You know, someone who's um who actually uh cares for you. Ain't gonna give you the run around. Two lines. What's going on? Waiting. What y'all waiting on, huh? What you waiting? But you're still busy though. You're still doing your thing. You're still getting it in. So that's cool. So you had to cut somebody out in order to get somebody that you like and love that see just like you. So now you're waiting. Mm. Mm. Oh, we back. We back. We had to pay the bill real quick. Lights went out. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and clarify a couple of these things real quick. We're going to see what's up with that. Queen of Swords. Why you had to cut a mug off? Let's see what you got to say. Ooh, ooh. Two. Two cards. You had to cut a mug off. Oh. We got the devil. Because there was some toxic energy involved. Dealing with that King of Pentacles. Oh, man. So the Queen of Swords is like, damn. Got to go ahead and cut off this uh, this King of Pentacles, man, because there's some devilish going down. You know what I mean? Some codependency issues, probably. You know, somebody was probably paying for all, all the stuff, and the other person was probably just receiving. Like, you know, like, hey, you know what I'm saying? And being codependent on that. You know, taking care of the relationship. The Queen of Swords like, I don't want that no more. I'm trying to get my two of cups. Trying to get my two of cups. And Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Ooh. We're going to clarify what's going on with them two of cups. Trying to get it. Oh, you're trying to get it. I feel you though, man. Some of this stuff be toxic. You don't want to be just, you know, always putting up with it. Man, okay. Let me uh, put that around real quick. Ooh, ooh, spirit want to come out with the whoop. Oh, spirit just like, yo, you're going to keep that on my hand at the end. <laughs> That's the six of pinnacles, man. So, basically, with your two of cups, man, you you sitting back thinking about sending a, a truthful message to kind of end your heartbreak. And, you know, it's kind of, it's, it's you're stuck there. You're sitting like, man, okay, I want to send this message. Let me look at, let me look at the whole situation. I want to send it, but <sighs> I'm just going to sit back and look. You know what I'm saying? That's what the page is for. You're sitting back like looking, you know, maybe checking social media or something like that. Or, you know, they could be doing that to, to you. I kind of got a feeling it's you. Yeah, I ain't. <clears throat> you don't want that. That's why. Now, they could be looking at you and don't want to experience it too. So they could be in the hangman mode. So... They could have probably messed up. And being at this one to jump out, the pen, Six of Pentacles, ooh, they want to they wanna be fair. They want to make things even again. You know what I'm saying? And so it's like, dang, whatever heartbreak that they, that they may envision, they're like, oh, man, I do want to make it fair. 
Hey, I'm just going to sit there and watch. Well, let's see what, the, see what they or you are waiting for. Ooh, man, there's some energy on the board. Boy, them Sagittarius and Aries and Leos. All right, cool. All right. Let me make sure see what y'all got to say. Okay, boom. We clarifying that to a wizard. We come to see. Ooh, that wanted to come out. I already know that. Ooh. All right. We're going to take all of them. We're going to take the group right here. So, the bottom of the deck. Oh, it's the boo. But we don't do the reverse here. You already know what's up. So, man, so you're waiting on. We got the Queen of Pentacles. Ten of Cups. King of Wands. Oh, that's some major arcanas up on this giant. It's a lot of energy. So, basically, you're sitting back and you're like, okay, I want my stable life. You know, I want to have love. I see my love. Do you see it? We got to pay the bills again? Oh. Okay. All right, cool. We back. <laughs> So they're like, dang, you know, that could mean something. Lights went out. And they're loving. Mmm. And that's what you want is that ten of cups. But with that ten of cups, uh, someone may be rushing towards you passionately to get that ten of cups and that stability. Since you was waiting. Or they waiting on you. It's one or the other. Now, sometimes you're dealing with the night, man. The night energy is kind of like, okay, I'm coming back around because, you know, you know, I, I had some things that I had to cut off in the past, you know, because uh, it was a toxic situation. But I do know that you are my ten of cups, my happiness, my joy. And I want to build a stable foundation with you. That's the Queen of Pentacles. So I can't wait. I got to come rushing in. Right now. But with this night energy. Sometimes the night energy ain't the right energy. But it'll be. So. But that's just to let you know that, hey. They, they ready for you. You know what I mean? So. That's pretty much it. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and get a um, a real uh, a answer from the universe. I'm gonna say a real, but it's an answer from the universe and see what the universe got to say about this. You know what I'm saying? One card draw. What does the universe have to say about this situation? We got the five of wands. It's conflicted. Someone's conflicted, or it's just a big conflicted situation that's going down. And yeah, I need some water in my belly. <laughs> but uh, it's it's a uh, conflicted situation going around this to get the, that ten of cups, you know. But a person is like, "Yo, man, I don't care. I'm gonna go ahead and rush in passionately because I've been waiting too damn long." Now. Fire signs, if that resonates with you, you can go ahead and comment below. If it don't, hey, let that just slide. But if you haven't already, subscribe!